Good morning, Blue. Got you all wiped down. You're looking pretty good. Not bad for a winter day. I'm gonna get my stuff inside. We're gonna head into Saskatchewan. I have a load waiting for me. The trailer is at our yard waiting there. Gotta go hook onto it. I've got those six skids that I picked up on Friday. I'm bringing those to Langbank, Saskatchewan. That's the whole load. We were told that it was gonna be with 40,000 pounds. That's what my message said, 40,000 pounds, full 53 foot trailer. And that's all they're sending. So we're gonna send it. Going to Langbank, Saskatchewan. From Langbank, I'm gonna deliver their first thing tomorrow morning. Right after I'm done unloading, they're gonna reload me with new stuff right there. And that comes back to Winnipeg. That's the plan for the next couple of days. Right now, just need to get all my stuff into the truck, get settled in, get the truck running, warmed up, and hit the road. We got old blue outside. Now before we bring in the pickup truck to store here while we're on our trip, old blue left a mess behind. We can't leave that there. Because if I don't clean it up, no one will clean it up. I'm gonna clean this out before I bring the pickup in here. It's rude to put the pickup in here in such a, on such a dirty floor. The pickup doesn't deserve that. The pickup didn't do anything to make this mess. You always clean up after yourself. I'm gonna get this all out of here. So what I do is I soak the floor, some soap and water, and then I push it all out. There is a floor drain right there, but I don't want all this dirt to go down the drain. So I let it soak, and then I push it all underneath that crack in the door right there. Get it out of here. That's where it belongs. All this uh, salt, sand, gunk. Let's see? Definitely don't want to leave that in here. And voila. Not 100%, but better. All of the uh, salt and sand is out of here. And the rest of these, I don't spot you, they'll dry up. Okay, so I'm gonna pull the pickup in here, get in the truck, go get my trailer, and point my nose towards Saskatchewan. Let's go. There's my trailer. That flatbed right between those van trailers. That'd be it. 108 DB. We're gonna be friends again this week. Right? You gonna treat me good, I'll treat you good? Is that the deal? brakes are not frozen we're gonna find out very soon I'm gonna tie down these tarps up here double check everything here this is my whole load that's it well, thankfully there's no frozen brakes on this trailer it's because when I dropped it on Friday I sat there for 10 minutes I think it was almost 15 minutes actually, just letting the trailer cool down before setting the trailer brakes. It seemed that plan worked. It's good. So we're ready to rock. Very light load, 5,500 pounds. I've got this protection over this here. I didn't want to scratch that paint. I don't know what this is for, but... Uh, Something for agriculture. I'm gonna quickly go in, use the bathroom, brush my teeth. Looks like we'll be driving into the darkness. I was hoping to get going a little bit earlier today, but I stayed home as long as I could. It's only 
a five hour drive today, so it's I don't got a, a long way to go. May as well make the most of my time at home. Come on, gate, let's go. Slowest gate around. There we go, alright. Last night and got unloaded first thing this morning but someone cut in front of me they cut in line first thing in the morning so I was waiting in line right where we're supposed to wait and they open up at 7 and it was uh, 6 50 10 to 7 and I was already had the truck running had the lights on sitting in my driver's seat waiting for them to tell me to move up and then a, a truck comes from behind me blows right past me pulls into the staging area and starts taking his straps off and they didn't stop them. So I just drove right in too. And uh, I mentioned, uh, I've been here since last night. Like, oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. So they uh, they still unloaded him first, then reloaded him. 
And then they came and unloaded me. And then reloaded me. And now here I sit. Got my new load on, I'll quickly show it to you. It's not a big deal. I mean I'm not in not in that big of a rush. Not a big deal. I just I don't like it when people cheat. I don't like it at all. But this is my new load. Just two rack systems that are going back to Winnipeg. I don't know what they're for, but here they are. So it all worked out. We're fine. Fine. Yeah, this is where I've got to end today's video. Yeah, I drove into the night and we've got to start tomorrow's video. So take care, everybody. Don't forget, stay safe out there. Drive safe. If you want early access to my videos and special recognition in the comment sections here, you can become a member of my channel by going down below and clicking the join button. You can read more about it there. Thanks everybody, and I'll see you tomorrow.